I'm such an old soul, y'all. I love this crispy crackers, sunshine biscuits. My niche is um, kitchenware. Oh, like look at this peanut butter jar. Super cool. I just love old tins. What'd you find, Matthew? This is my niche. This is his niche. What is it? 1985 Wuggle. Mm-hmm. From Hasbro. I'm looking it up. All right, we'll cut. We'll see what price he comes up with. <gasps> Rainbow bright dog. Wow, that's cool. How much? Uh, they are fifteen dollars, but thirty percent. So seven fifty each. Let's see. What do we want to eat today? You want some corn? You want a carrot? You want a radish? Scarlet? Oh, radish. I love these. Oh, I gotta get the mushroom. Yes, caps off to you. Who is she? <laughs> Just giving her a pet. Hi, Brittany. Look at this lion. Look, I'm already over it. I didn't mean to though. That is cool. Looks like a Holland mold or something. Cute, cute, cute. Where's the tiki? So we found out they're about $10 each, but they only collect about 18 with free shipping. So back they go. If it was for us, we would snatch those up. Look at her in her little case overlooking the land. Scarlet. This is a really cool book for $25. It can go for $30. So be on the lookout for Mr. Willoughby's Christmas tree. Love that. Whopper Airlines. I'm not going to get it though, but I'm going to look out for that. And this is a really cool toy. We sold a little Santa one. And it's by... The first years. Also, I collect these kind of plates. I love the vintage McDonald's little Fry Guys plate. Exactly where these are from. This is from an Avon Christmas Hostess set that we have in our bathroom. It has a tree that you stick um, little appetizers on. It's very kitschy. In fact, I have two of them. Fun fact, just got this Dolly-like painting. I love Salvador Dali. And, ooh, this is kind of cute. Oh, they're napkin rings. I thought they were salt and pepper. Anyways, I just love this place. It's been such a long time since we've been. You can find some really good prices for certain things. They always have some kind of a sale. Look at these egg cups. Interesting. How much are they? Oh, it's a pitcher. Ooh, no, no, no. <laughs> Cool though. Betty Boop's Sleepy Time. Fine bed linens. Where are you, Tiki? Why can't I find you? Ooh, chocolate bunnies. How cute. Got more comics. Love that bear. Yeah. Oh, cool. Good sign. Bubba's annual. Twelve dollars. So this is what we were talking about in our recent haul, Gail Pittman. A uh, Gail Pittman pitcher. So 
so interesting. It's twelve dollars, but twenty percent off. So, oh, I like that cast iron ship. So maybe not enough meat on the bone for that. Look at that poodle. Love this lamp. Love this man. I love this booth name, Fifty Shades of Rust. I love wall pockets. I don't have very many, but ooh, these are cool. Are these obsidian? I love Freddy the Frog, that's cool. Avon, I might get that. It's 15% off everything over $5. Oh man, oh, I still might get that. These I think are McCoy. Yep. I love cookie jars, that's probably McCoy also. This is McCoy, I have that. But I see it a lot. Hmm, this is interesting. I was thinking that was Van Briggle or something, but now that I think about it, it doesn't look like Van Briggle. Work. See, I see a lot of stuff. This is Franciscan apple. I love these carrots. I wish they were in better condition. Love jadeite. I just got a George Briard cup that was right here that y'all will have to see in a haul. Um, this is beautiful. It's Hazel S. <laughs> Hazel S. Hazel Atlas um, Sherbert dish. But it looks like modern tone to me. I think that's really, really pretty. It reminds me of the 50s or 40s. I thought this was pretty too. Um, and of course we have the um, Franciscan app, uh, Franciscan, I can't talk, <laughs> Franciscan autumn leaves. Um, yeah, I was going to come back here. Does this have a green star? No, it doesn't. Very tempted. Have ever seen a doily stretcher? Well, now you have. It's firm price, $44. That's interesting. You know, I've found several Helen Corbett's cookbooks where they've been signed. I think she signed a lot of them. Not this one. I think she was popular like Julia Child, but maybe not. What do I know? I love kitchen stuff, so maybe there's some cool things to be found. Great story, Erin. I wonder if this is Bakelite. It just says knife. <laughs> Love how old that is. Look at these little fuzzy eggs. Oh, those are pumpkins, not eggs. <laughs> and now you know, America. I don't know, I just wanted to say that. Look, Shirley Temple. Ooh, oh, I thought that said $2. These are Fire King, aren't they? Yep. Anchor Hawkin Fire King. Jug of water. Did it really have water? Nicely curated booth. What are these? Stamps. Oh, look at this uh, Paisley Culver drink set. Wow, $88. I, I believe it. Those are beautiful. I thought that was a bell pepper. I bet that's heavy as you know what. Oh, shoot. The Cane Mutiny. Beautiful. Gorgeous. Got some ships. Got a trumpet. We've got these, Royal Dalton. That's probably not that bad of a price, $25. Oh, that's a beautiful face. 
love this mid-century shadow box that has mirrors. That is really cool. What do you call that style, Matthew? Like string art? Not really. It is? Mm -hmm. Very cool. My mom was looking for a yellow enamel teapot. I'm not even kidding. $14. I'm going to ask my mom about this. Yesterday. Okay, we'll see. Hi, Matthew. Froggy. What does it say? And what does she have? <sighs> you girl. <laughs> I don't know. I, I want to find a puff along. What does the other one say? Babe. And golf nut. And golf nut. <laughs> Look, she has little chairs or apples. She has little cookies. And then you have the kitties. Help me. Do you see these kitties? Whoa. Look at this troll. Mm -hmm. Electro kids. Yeah. Cabbage. Little cabbage. Look, we have this painting, but it's 125 for all three. Um, also, I really like this. It looks familiar. Let's see. Let's see who made it. No one I know. And look at her piggy tails. Okay, y'all. Award for the most ornate way to store your toilet roll. Too bad there's none in there. What you looking at? Is that um, sealed, our lady we like? Sealed with a kiss. Oh, oh, we sell that good. Mm -hmm. It'd be $7.50. Oh, wow. I say get it. We gotta look it up first. Yeah, it's really cool though. Okay, something caught my eye. Look at this. Legend of the Crucifix Fish. I will let you pause it to read it. That is super interesting. It's almost time to go. Oh, there's a penguin ice bucket. Let's see how much that is. Actually, it's called a hot and cold server. See? Oh, penguin. Why do they write on it? Since it's Sharpie, it actually might come off, but still. Use a price tag for heaven. All right, we have a really cool kitchen area with lots of Pyrex. I love the refrigerator dishes. And I've seen this scale many times. I kind of want this little bar jug from Pearson's or Pearson's to be $5. I'm going to think about that. Got this Nordic Ware pineapple upside down cake pan. It's going to be $14. I kind of want it. We got some Burwood clocks. I have the L one. I really like this one. I started collecting them, but then I realized I don't really have room to hang any of them. I actually used this nut chopper. I'm such an old soul, y'all. No, it worked like a charm. And you can find them pretty easily at thrift stores. I love chalkware. I need to make some more this summer. Two summers I haven't. That's really cute. Yeah. Anyways, oh, I love this owl cookie jar. Reminds me of Treasure Craft. I wonder if it is. Treasure Craft kind of has that look to it. Very cool. Anyways, we're about to wrap up because the store closes in 40 minutes. Sometimes it can take a long time to check out at this place at any antique store really, if you have a lot of stuff because they have to plug in all the numbers. There's still so much more to see. Yeah, look at this General Mills Boo Berry cereal uh, little squeeze toy. <laughs> I want it, but it's $10. I don't need to be doing that. These are toothpick holders. I bet some of y'all knew that. All right, got a light bright. It's funny, the boxes are always in horrible condition. Oh, look at that mid-century graphic.
Ooh, scary. Is that Bozo the Clown? I bet you that's <laughs> baby that away. Oh, this is cool. I've never seen precious moments, little bears like that. Oh, bless you. So y'all, I've always loved this booth and it's 80% off, but their prices are way marked up and it's so hard to get in there. You know, you should pack your booth, but not, not this much. I mean, look at that, you can't get through it. That's gonna turn off a bunch of potential customers. But some people like to dig, but for the average shopper, I think they wouldn't wanna go in there. Let me know in the comments if you go in here. I mean, I would, <laughs> and I have. And I will, and I am. <laughs> Anyways, lots of cool treasure though. Don't get me wrong. Y'all look at this animatronic Elmo and I'm guessing the pizza talks. <laughs> I love it. Hey guys, it's Matt talking for Aaron since his mic didn't work. Don't forget to hit that subscribe button. Leave us a comment if you saw something that you liked and keep digging for treasure. Because remember, it's not hoarding. If you at least try to sell it, Thanks, guys. Bye.